Good morning guys. It is morning. It is 20 past 7. I'm sitting here waiting for my video to render. It's like 2% left and then I'm gonna head off to work. Uh, it's gonna be the busiest week ever. We have basically everything to do. Uh, we have to pack our bags. I have to go shopping today for a whole bunch of things that I didn't have time to do uh, last Friday or didn't have money for last Friday which I have money for now I'm supposed to, gosh, I'm supposed to go and get uh, change some money so we have money when we get out yeah all that jazz is going to happen tonight, to evening, this evening and on top of that I have a card I want to make hopefully I have time to do it if I have time to do it I will actually be able to be, be in the blog hop um, because we got the stamps tonight so we'll see I already said to to the RDT that I might not be able to but I'm gonna look into it because we got the stamps I we'll always get the stamps like pre pre done okay I'm, I'm gonna hide some things because you can't see them but look at this this is the, the tiniest little box and he loves lying there. Uh, yeah, he wants to move the things away also because it's my box. Yeah. But yeah, um, I have a whole bunch of things that I need to do for the next couple of days. On Thursday the kitties are going to go to their kitty sitter. <sighs> And yeah, this is going to be the fastest going week ever, and then we're off! Whee! Well guys, uh, it's evening, it's been a very long day. Um, after I was at work, I went by some stores to get some some um, stuff, for, and on the way home I actually got a charger for Christopher, as the kitty has eaten his charger again. A charger for me, and when I got the charger home, I realized I have two others for our, my mobile phone. Or Christopher find two others for, for our mobile phones. So I might just have paid a lot of money without needing it. But now I have one, so yeah. And I got some packing boxes to pack like underwear and actually my meds fits perfectly in one of the smaller ones so that was awesome um, and yeah a lot of a lot of things gosh a long day um, I posted a craft video this morning that went live I still have a lot to annotate it I have to do that maybe tomorrow or something Right now I'm, I'm a little bit too tired to do anything really. <laughs> and and then I got home and I worked some more. And then I put my cross stage, took my cross stage because I'm a little bit too tired to do anything in the craft room. Well, actually, I did colour a couple of images because I needed some colouring therapy. And then I did some cross stitching. It is day one of the head cell over at Cross Stitch and Discuss 2. So that have I done today. And this is my progress from nothing to this. Looky here. It always goes much faster when you have like this with a, a lot of the same colors. These are the total of three colors. I'm on my third up here somewhere. Oh, there. There's the needle. Here. So, this is three different greys. It's going to be a lot of grey in the beginning, but it's actually, it's enough variation to be kind of cool. And we'll see, because this went so fast, so I'm so stoked to continue. Then I opened uh, a whole bunch of windows in my calendar as I said before I have bought one of these advent calendars for uh, Lego Star Wars and as I'm not here for Christmas I decided I wanted to make, to kind of open one every day uh, until the trip 
the vacation. There's just one thing. Um, I have not, I've forgotten. Uh, I had it in a very good place in the beginning, so I started with the first couple of boxes. And then it, I just forgot. So I've been opening, I think I opened like 10 or something today. That was quite funny because it was a lot of fun things to build together and stuff. So yeah, it was a very good way to finish the night. I am going to head to bed now because I'm really, really tired. I have to go up to work tomorrow, um, talk a little bit with my boss and stuff. But yeah. Oh, I have one thing to say. I, I don't think I actually told you, so I th thought I, I, I'd tell you now. Um, I told you about me going to have some tests done for my gynecologist. Uh, and that I also had some tests done for my uh, rheumatologist. Rem, 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 doctor? Oh God, I don't know how to pronounce that word. I know how to pronounce it in Swedish. In English, it's just nah, doesn't work. In Swedish, we say rematolog. So yeah, but I have talked to my that doctor, and she's fine with letting me go to the trip so I'm really, really happy about that <sighs> big thing lifted from my shoulders uh, knowing that I'm I'm totally okay to to leave the country and everything so that, that's awesome number two uh, the test I took for my gynecologist shows that my hormone levels are back to normal this doesn't mean that everything is a-okay because it seems like the hormones are helping my ovaries to kind of come up to normal and every time I've gone back gone off them um, it takes a couple of months but then they're back at not working again but I am dropping the hormones again to see what can happen which is very very good actually because that won't then they won't interfere with my sleep, which it's a very big risk that they do otherwise. So yeah, it was good news all around. That is that is actually really really awesome. All of the good news. So I've been in a pretty good mood the last couple of days. But yeah. But I'm gonna head to bed. So good night, sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Bye.